good day ladies and gents or it would make more sense to say bad day ladies and gents because i am not in favor of the current changes bsg are rolling out uh, we're gonna go through the changes i'm gonna tell you what happened and i'll share some thoughts what might happen next and well, i'm not uh, exactly happy with this so first of all bsg removed our favorite sides from the traders uh voodoo and razor and they left only tech 30 in an exchange for the class yes there we go jaeger trades for three classes and that's the only way to get the sides of course you can still buy them on the flea but i wouldn't be surprised if vg bans them on the flea as well that's the first thing secondly all the top tier ammos were either removed or moved to a high level i would say most of them were removed and M80 was moved to max level Peacekeeper. I don't think this is a good change because M80 is basically a lower entry point for 308 caliber. I don't see a reason to play with anything below uh, M80. Either you're using um, light noise, uh, no, no, no noise layer bullet or whatever it's called, or TCX. They just have zero penetration. I don't see a reason to use that. With such insane recoil for 308 guns, it makes no sense to use any bullet lower than M80. And right now, to get M80, you need to go to Peacekeeper and unlock the max level, which most of the people will not be getting uh, for the next few months, let's say. Also, M80 is banned from the flea market, so you can't buy it on the flea, even if you unlock a uh, flea market on level 15. Nice. Also, people might say, like, yeah, bro, this is how Tarkov is supposed to be. It's supposed to be hardcore, like, this is how you play the game, it's, it's very difficult, man, you need to find loot, you need to survive. Yes, bro, but what, like, what about average average people that play the game? Like, they can't unlock that stuff till the end of the wipe. How are they supposed to enjoy things? Me, streamer, or like the other guys who play 10 hours a day? Yeah, fine, whatever. We're gonna we're gonna grind it. We're gonna, I don't know, kill some raiders. We're gonna buy the bullets every single reset because we can unlock traders like within a week. Uh, we'll be fine, but like, I feel sorry for casuals, bro. I want everybody to enjoy the game. Like, it doesn't have to be that hard. And I think BG is crazy for that reason, but that's not the only reason I think they're crazy for making this change at this very moment. Another thing, I think it's just a very bad timing to implement this change. Right now, there are so many problems. People are having sound issues. Sometimes when the sound is on the left, your enemy is on the right, and I'm not joking. Uh, uh, cheater issues. FPS issues on different maps. Some people are getting um, blue screens. Like there are plenty of issues I can talk about, but I'm not going to. It's just I think it's it's generally a poor timing to implement a change, which makes the game harder. While people are already suffering from the hardest of the game, uh, combined with the bugs which is supposed to be fixed, I purely believe this is a, a really bad timing to implement this change. Oh yeah, by the way, impact nades have been removed from proper as well. That's a good change. I, I like it. At least, at least, at least something I like um, in this update. <laughs> so, if BG is making all the bullets RAM, I hope they're gonna keep the armors in the game and armor availability should be should be easy. Otherwise, it makes no sense to get rid of all the high tier ammo and high tier armors because the meta is just gonna shift to low end bullets and it makes no sense. So, hopefully, everybody will be able to get decent armor and not everybody will be able to get decent bullets. That's the whole point. Everybody will be running decent ammo and overall time to kill is going to increase. It will take you more shots on average to kill someone. If that's what BSG type try to implement, I'm pretty happy with that. I'm just not really happy with the execution. Uh, yeah, it just, it just all of it just went too fast, man. And we had no notifications from BSG. They could have like tweeted out, we want to shift the meta or we want to do this or we want to do that. Things like this come as a strike, and without actually knowing what their plan is, it's a bit it's a bit tough to analyze things. To be honest, I know they're moving towards like very hardcore game and all of that stuff, but like, come on, at least give us at least give us some info so people know what's happening. Like that, that's it. We, I just want to know what's happening. At the same time, flea market starts to make less sense for me. It looks like most of the items are banned from it. Right now, every single bullet, I'm gonna say every single bullet because every single useful bullet is banned from the flea. You can't, you can't even buy BT bullets for AK-545, which is like a low tier ammo. Like, I don't know, man. Right now, people are using flea to buy mags. Some of the attachments, which is still not banned, and I won't be surprised if BG banned top tier attachments, top tier suppressors, and top tier sites like Voodoo, which they already banned from traders. Um, armors are banned, you can't buy slicks, you can't buy level 5 armors, you can't buy helmets either. 
yeah man i don't really know what else i want to say chat i shared my uh main thoughts uh and yeah let's see what else bg is gonna bring to the game overall as i said i don't think this is a great update for casuals i am personally not happy with the execution even though bg might have had good plans to make the game hotter i don't think they executed it perfectly um, and yeah, let me let me know in the comments down below what you think about this update. Are you are you for it or are you against it? Do you think do you think it's a good change because uh, people won't be able to get good bullets and everybody will be playing low tier guns um, till like mid end of the wipe? Or you actually think that's a bullshit update and uh, it's just gonna make the game difficult and it's gonna make players leave the game? Yeah, let me know what you think and don't forget to slap a thumbs up on this video and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching.